Walking by the water is one of my favorite things to do. Henry David Thoreau in Walden talks about the change people go through in life. He says when he first went to the woods, he went with a pole and a gun. And later in life, he took pencil and paper. And later after that, he just went and listened. One of the reasons why I like to go walk by the water is because the water, the earth, and all the sounds and feelings, that's my internet, that's my TV, it's my entertainment. Uh, it feels good to do walking by the water. When I go walk by the water, I never know what I'm going to see. When I go videotape, I just take the camera with me. I, I do go at times where, and I go into habitat where I know there are beaver. I like to film beaver. And so there are things in the riparian habitat that I do get to see, like the muskrat and beavers. But there's no guarantee that I'll see anything. I'll always hear the water. I'll always feel that water. I'll always feel that good energy. That's one of the reasons why I like to walk by the water is that great energy. That water. This spring I found a place called Beaver Bend. I call it Beaver Bend for a reason. It's a bend in the river and there's a beaver family who has a den in the bank there. So I see beavers there frequently and so I call it Beaver Bend and I love to go to Beaver Bend. Tonight this beaver on, at Beaver Bend, it, it was tricky. We call Coyote the trickster, but beavers are tricky too. And they're very curious, they like to listen to people. They'll sneak up behind you and listen to you. Beavers in the Portner River, they'll swim downstream. And they, they'll get in that channel and they'll flow down with the current. But when they go upstream, they go close, close to the bank on the side of the river. It's kind of the slack water, so it takes less energy. And this beaver tonight sneaks right by me. I thought I was gonna get like a great up close shot. The grass was too high and I never did get that great up close shot with the camera, but I did with my eyes. It was like within a foot, it was cool. Portner River starts on the Fort Hall Indian Reservation, starts off beautiful, beautiful, clear, clear, beautiful water. By the time it gets to Pocatello, it's not so clear, but it's still water and it has, it's still cool. Although it's not clear blue, it's cool because it has a strong spirit and it helps me to remember I am water. Water is worth fighting for. Clean water, happy water, fight for it. <laughs>